Hi friends, Bright Careers welcomes you to another brand new video for this week. This is Yes Sudarshan, your career coach. Right, this week we are going to see a topic that's one of the niche fields in the area of engineering. Yes, the topic for this week is careers in biomedical engineering. Right, so what is biomedical engineering? Many people uh, know that there is a branch called biomedical engineering. Many people know that there is also a branch called biotechnology. Quite often people confuse with biomedical and biotechnology. At this point in time, I would like to say both are uniquely different. But for this week, we are only going to see about biomedical engineering. In some other time, we will definitely see about biotechnology as a career. So what is biomedical engineering? So biomedical engineering is a unique blend, I would say, unique blend of two different parts. One is the biological sciences and other one is the engineering. So when, when the blend of biological sciences and engineering come together, that's biomedical sciences. It is definitely a booming field, I should say, as it has the deadly combination of healthcare and engineering. So in, in layman's language, it is healthcare combined with engineering principles. That's biomedical engineering. I will give you a very practical and layman example so that we all understand what biomedical engineering is. I'm sure that you all would have visited hospitals, right? If you go to a hospital, I'm sure there is something called ICU, which we all are aware. Now, when you visit an ICU, there you usually see come across some complex machines like ECG machines that tells the heart pulse, pulse rate, etc. It goes like this, fluctuates, etc. Those are the examples of biomedical engineering. Now, biomedical engineers are the ones who manufacture or who invent those machineries that are there inside the hospital. So manufacturing of various medical devices, be it small or big, are done by biomedical engineers. So some example includes the pacemaker that we keep in the heart, the micro macro implants that happens, you know, in, in, in during the surgery and then body scanning machines like MRI. We would have come across this language called term called MRI. So MRI scans, MRI, EEG machines are some of the greatest gifts of biomedical engineering to the society. So biomedical engineering is in short nothing but inventing, creating and manufacturing of hospital or healthcare related devices in an engineering way. So that's biomedical engineering. So now moving on, what are the skills that are required to become a biomedical engineering? As we have already seen that this branch is a very, very rare and unique branch. Therefore, it requires the mindset of an engineer along with the healthcare mindset. So which means you got to have the aptitude of engineering principles, very strong engineering principles and also an aptitude for healthcare industry or hospital industry. So biomedical engineering, if you think are only creators of, of equipments or medical related devices, no, they also work in IT. I'll tell you how they also create softwares and computer systems for healthcare. There are huge software that analyzes the health, right? Now all those things are done by biomedical engineers. So, all you need is if you want to become a career, make a career in biomedical engineering, you got to have this analytical skills, a uh, good eye for design. You also need to empathize with the patients, uh, patients that the hospital patients, uh, attention for detailing is a must and above all teamwork. So these are some of the etiquettes or attributes that's required if you want to make a career in biomedical engineering. Moving on, what are the career opportunities that exist in biomedical engineering or for biomedical engineers. The first thing definitely is they can work for corporate firms. They can work in large corporate firms in the R&D domain. Uh, some firms like, uh, uh, you know, not only in R&D domain, but also in QA, quality assurance domain. So some firm companies like uh, Gamesa or Siemens Healthcare, GE Healthcare, uh, Philips Healthcare, Johnson Johnson, uh, Toshiba, Samsung Healthcare. See, these are the companies where a biomedical engineer can get into as the core. They can also work for IT companies, which we saw earlier. So that is the first career opportunity. They can work for corporates. The second career opportunity is they can definitely get into the R&D. So research and development. So biomedical engineers work as R&Ds. They work with physicians to create those complex machines. They work with doctors basically and create those complex machines and solve lot of uh, chemical problems. So that's something a biomedical engineering can do. That's a second professional career opportunity. Naturally, they can work with hospitals in in uh, in, uh, in acquiring machines or in, in manufacturing or op maintaining those machines. So these are the areas where a biomedical engineer can work with. What are the specializations? So biomedical engineering is also a vast field, even though it's a niche field in 
in engineering it's it's a vast domain by itself some of the specializations that you can make as a student definitely is you can get into bio instrumentation you can get into bio materials you can become a biomechanics specialist this biomechanics we call you would have heard this term in sports biomechanics uh, specialist and then you can get into the clinical engineering part you can also get into tissue engineering which is also becoming popular these days so these are some of the sub specialization that's available in biomedical engineering where to study definitely iits multiple locations across the country offer this program you also have bits offering this program nits multiple location will offer this program and then leading private universities in the country that includes vits and srms and amritas and manipals they will definitely offer you such programs all the state government universities like anna university etc offer this program and then those affiliated colleges will offer you this program so these are some of the places where you can study in india as always in our segment the pros and cons of studying uh, biomedical engineering the pros first uh, definitely it's a great opportunity to work in a research domain and core domain so you get to know a lot of things that's happening around in healthcare industry uh, also not only that you also become a part of a revolution you know the, in in healthcare industry all those machines are revolutionary right so you become a part of the revolution straight away uh, it's definitely a practical industry i should say it's not that theoretical it's practical industry not only industry practical field so these are some of the pros as always some of the gray areas or the cons it's definitely a niche industry we saw it's not the core engineering industry like the mechanicals or electricals or electronics or computer science it's not the core it's a niche industry you got you will be working for you know, only for a segment of industries like like hospitals or it companies or corporates etc uh, and mostly into r and d so you know when you compare with other engineering branches it is not so core when it comes to the study of engineering also it may not be rewarding for you in terms of uh, you know the the money or finance part when you compare yourself with a computer science engineer or some other branch but for those things uh, other things will remain the same finally healthcare industry if you ask me is already witnessing a huge upsurge we all know that due to covid and things like that it's already witnessing a huge upswing uh, due to various complexness and awareness people are already consumers i mean people are already consuming the 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 products or services that's been created by bio biomedical engineers without even knowing whether that's created by biomedical engineers or not so it is definitely a consumable one and it's already being used heavily extensively uh, this will definitely uh, create some kind of hike or this will definitely witness a hike i should say in employment as well as salary in years to come so if you are keen about this the specialization or combination of engineering with healthcare right do go ahead and choose biomedical engineering it's a definitely one of it's definitely one of the good branches in engineering stream and in case you want to know whether you are fit enough to pursue or study biomedical engineering do keep in touch with us do ping us all the details are mentioned you know inside uh, beneath this video you can always ping me for all those details thank you once again and do subscribe to my youtube channel which is www.youtube.com/rightcareers and in case you haven't uh, you know do that and then also click on the subscription button for instant notification until next week with a brand new video see you all take care have a great week thank you